In this screencast, you will be shown how to add a learning module, add an item to that learning module, and then add a file to the learning module. So first of all, um, from your course content page, so course content, learning modules, here we can add the learning module. So let's go to learning module down here. Give it a name. It's module two families in this case. Um, you can add a description in here about it. Permit users to view, yes. Um, no date and time restriction set here. Um, do you want to enforce sequential viewing of the learning module? Um, no. Open a new window, maybe yes. And track number of views, yes. Do you want to show the table of content to users? Yes, probably a good idea. And then display, you can order them by, by letters, um, numbers. Um, I will select none. And then click on submit. So here you see we've added the learning module. Now inside this learning module, um, let's click on this, it's best to add probably an introduction to start off and we'll also add a file with the textbook content. So to build content we need to put in an item for the introduction. Give it a name, introduction, put in the text, so that's done. Um, do you need to add an attachment? Uh, you might have a, a more of a, a detailed um, int introduction of the unit, so you can add that there as a, an extra file. Permit users to view this constant, OK, track number of views, and we leave this open as well. Then click on Submit. So now we've added the introduction here. The next thing that we want to do is add a file. This will be a PDF of the uh, course book. The file will be a PDF file. Um, let's browse the content collection. We've already uploaded this. And here it is in our content collection. So click on Course Content, Learning Modules, Module 2, and here is the uh, PDF file. It's a scanned version of the textbook. Once you've selected that, click on Submit. And it's been added here. The name comes up. The default is the name of the file. So we might want to say this will be textbook, maybe textbook unit two families. Uh, open in a new window, probably best. Um, track number of views, yes. And we leave the time and date open. Click on submit. We've added the uh, item and the file here. Um, let's have a look at what the student will see. So you need to go to edit mode is off. So click on that, edit mode off. So the student will see this. They will see an introduction here. They'll have to click through here or here to see the, the PDF file will open up here. 